Item. SCP-004. Object Class. Euclid. Special Containment Procedures. When handling items SCP-0042 through SCP-0014, proper procedure is vital. The items are not permitted to be moved off-site unless accompanied by two Level 4 security personnel. Under no circumstances should any other component of SCP-004 be taken through SCP-0041. The effects of doing so are as yet unknown, and the current cost of experimentation makes further research impractical. Should any of the objects contained within SCP-0041 breach containment, or the facility be breached, the keys must be brought inside and the door closed prior to activation of Site-62's on-site warhead. Unauthorized removal of keys from the testing area is grounds for immediate termination. Level 1 clearance is required for basic access to SCP-0041. Level 4 clearance is required for use of SCP-0042-13. Description. SCP-004 consists of an old wooden barn door. SCP-0041 and a set of 12 rusted steel keys. SCP-0042 through SCP-0043. The door itself is the entrance to an abandoned factory in Data Expunged. Item. SCP-00414. Date of Discovery. The 9th of February 1950. Origin of Object. Object was discovered elsewhere in factory area. In the previously undiscovered manager's office. Description. Object appears as a large, unvarnished wooden box. The box may be unlocked by the safe key. SCP-0047. As well as five of the unsafe keys. See document SCP-0041. Upon unlocking SCP-0014 with SCP-0047. The box opens automatically on hinges. The volume of the space inside is precisely five times greater than the outer dimensions imply. Items placed within while the lid remains open do not affect the weight or any other properties of the box. When the lid is closed and locked, however, all items inside vanish irretrievably. Personnel locked inside the box are also irretrievable. Although losing personnel in this fashion appears to affect significantly the dreams experienced by Data Expunged.